According to my data stream, Chabarro has increased mining production to maximum levels. McKeb's destruction will arrive far ahead of schedule. You have a spacecraft, yes? We should depart immediately. We're not leaving our people behind. If Tabarro's drilling has accelerated McKeb's destruction, turning it off should slow it back down. I fear it won't be as easy as flipping switches. The platforms and their control rooms will be heavily defended. Everything on this planet has been an ordeal. I'd hate to break our perfect record. But don't worry. Those drilling lasers are going offline. If they don't, I doubt we'll see each other again. I'll have a transport to the mining platforms prepped for you immediately. Keep us apprised of your progress.
thanks for the assist. Private Vandalic, 8th Imperial Infantry. Might keep your distance. Insights leaking out. Don't try to move. We'll transport you out of here. Generous, but a waste of effort. Not much time. So listen. Wasn't always Imperial military. Born on Macab. Caught wind of the hot takeover. And volunteered for this. <laughs> Defend my old home. Now you don't sound like a typical Imperial. Didn't realize the military was recruiting outside their space. Was this... or mining? Bad choice, looking back. Or his were to... steal Isotope 5. But I wanted to help your evacuation. Still have... friends and family here. Shutting down drills... not enough. Need to open emergency release valves... at primary control center. Reduce core pressure. You're a soldier, not a geologist. How did you figure all this out on your own? I grew up on these platforms. My father was a foreman. Use slicer spike in control center's mainframe. Override HUD security lockout. Take control. Vent the core. Control center's heavily guarded. Sorry, that part's on you. Please get my people off this rock. On my honor as a Jedi, your loved ones will be saved. I believe you. Wish. I could stay. Lambda, Gez, we're at the drilling site's primary control center. An Imperial soldier, an ex-native, told us to open the emergency release valves. He said it was the only way to release planetary core pressure. Do you agree? Tectonic vibrations are still off the charts. Caranto Mesa just exploded. Good thing we're not there. Those drilling lasers were working overtime. The heat buildup beneath the planet's crust is massive. Venting the core would cool things off. All that heat has to go someplace. Is there a way we could direct it to take out Taboro's forces? Nice thought, but no. Normally, venting that much heat would cause an environmental catastrophe. But at this point, who cares? working. Readings show seismic activity falling quickly. That should buy you enough time to get the Ark's fuel rods. We're still cutting it awfully close. Can we use this equipment to reverse the core's damage? Well, if we had months, maybe. But we don't. We've had an interesting development while you were gone. Dr. Ogarab isn't the only hut on Makeb who's changing sides. The local hut cartel leaders, minus Taboro, want to negotiate with you personally. Hurry back to camp and meet us in the diplomatic tent. You sold us out to that maniac to borrow? Now that he's turned on you, we're supposed to save your skins? Incredible. Had we known Taboro was insane, we never would have supported him. He is no longer Hut Cartel. We formally shun him. However, in breaking ties with Taboro, we find ourselves stranded on Makeb with you. We are prepared to offer generous compensation for seating and cargo space aboard the Ark. Cargo? Are you delusional? Your bodies take up more room than a dozen good people. 
Ah, one of the Republic's greatest heroes. Just the person we could use to bring some wisdom and perspective to the discussion. Let me see if I understand. Tabaro's former friends got on his bad side. Now they need to get off Makeb, so they've come to us? The major cartel leaders have decided Tabaro is bad for business. They want peace. Most revered Republic champions, my masters apologize for this unfortunate situation. Surely we can reach a state of mutually beneficial recompense and earn passage aboard the Ark? My people deserve rescue. The Hut Cartel's leaders can't just beg their way out. Shalem's right. But these are the most powerful Huts in the galaxy. We can name our price to save their lives. And think what that means for defeating the Empire. You think we should combine forces with the Huts and attack the Empire together? We can't lose sight of the real enemy here. Or how much the Huts fear you. Taboro has lost his mind, and these cartel leaders know it. They can't go back to him. They need us. Honored Republic heroes, you are known for mercy and greatness. Can you find it within yourselves to forgive our profound error in judgment? Stop appealing to our sentimentality. Forgiveness isn't the issue here. Your masters want a ticket off Makeb, and we'll consider providing it. For the right price. Honored Republic negotiators, my masters will happily continue debasing themselves, but Makeb's time grows short. If you provide safe passage for my masters and their cargo, they will fully commit the cartel to an alliance with the Republic. Surely you find this agreeable? Inform your masters that they'll be allowed to board the Ark with the other refugees. Personal belongings will be loaded as space permits. First priority will be given to food, medicine, and other items essential to survival. Erodium plated statues will not qualify. We'll negotiate exactly what responsibilities the cartel has to the Republic once this crisis is over. We'll expect full cooperation. My masters wish no further hostilities with you. The offer is accepted without condition. I think you're the first in galactic history to force the Huts into a deal they can't afford. Now all we need are those fuel rods. Dr. Ogarab is with Shalem. You should coordinate with them. 